Hey there. Welcome back to Cosmic Quantum Quest. Today, we're going to explore the multiverse hypothesis. If you are a curious person, go ahead and subscribe so you won't miss the future videos. Let's begin. The multiverse hypothesis is the idea that our universe is not the only one, but rather that there are an infinite number of universes, each with its own laws of physics and history. The multiverse hypothesis is based on a number of different scientific theories, including quantum mechanics, string theory, and general relativity. Quantum mechanics suggests that there are many possible outcomes to any event, and that the outcome that we observe is simply the one that collapsed into reality. The many worlds interpretation of quantum mechanics takes this idea one step further and suggests that every time a quantum event occurs, the universe splits into multiple universes, one for each possible outcome. This means that there could be an infinite number of universes, each with its own unique history. String theory is a branch of physics that attempts to unify the four fundamental forces of nature. String theory requires the existence of 10 or 11 dimensions, but we only observe three spatial dimensions and one-time dimensions. The extra dimensions are thought to be curled up on an incredibly small scale. String theory also suggests that there may be other brains floating around in the multiverse, and that each brain could support its own universe. General relativity is the theory of gravity developed by Albert Einstein. General relativity describes gravity as a curvature of space-time. The multiverse hypothesis suggests that the curvature of space-time could be different in different universes, leading to different laws of physics and different histories. There is no direct evidence for the existence of the multiverse, but there are a number of indirect pieces of evidence that suggest that it could be real. For example, some scientists have interpreted the cosmic microwave background radiation, the leftover light from the Big Bang, as evidence for collisions between our universe and other universes. The multiverse hypothesis is a fascinating and thought-provoking idea. It has the potential to revolutionize our understanding of the universe and our place in it. However, it is important to remember that the multiverse hypothesis is still just a hypothesis. There is no concrete evidence to prove or disprove its existence. Here are some of the different types of multiverses that have been proposed by scientists. Many worlds, multiverse. This is the type of multiverse that is implied by the many worlds interpretation of quantum mechanics. In a many worlds, multiverse, there is a separate universe for every possible outcome of every quantum event. Inflationary multiverse. This type of multiverse is based on the theory of inflation. Inflation is a period of rapid expansion that is thought to have occurred in the early universe. The inflationary multiverse hypothesis suggests that inflation may have created an infinite number of universes, each with its own unique properties. Brain multiverse. This type of multiverse is based on string theory. The brain multiverse hypothesis suggests that there are an infinite number of brains floating around in the multiverse, and that each brain could support its own universe. Simulated multiverse. This type of multiverse is based on the idea that our universe is a simulation created by a more advanced civilization. The simulated multiverse hypothesis suggests that there could be an infinite number of simulations running in parallel, each with its own unique universe. The multiverse hypothesis is a complex and fascinating topic. There is still much that we do not know about the multiverse, but it is an idea that is worth exploring. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and hit that notification bell so you never miss our future videos. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.